Good morning, students. Today, I'm going to share a story with you by Corey Dorfeld entitled, The Rabbit Listened. I invite you to think about ways in which you might identify with one of the characters. The Rabbit Listened by Corey Dorfeld, published by Dial Books for Young Readers. For CC, JB, SAF, and everyone rebuilding. One day, Taylor decided to build something, something new, something special, something amazing. Taylor was so proud. I would be proud if I built something that amazing. Then, out of nowhere, Things came crashing down. How do we think that makes Taylor feel? The chicken was the first to notice. Cluck, cluck, what a shame. I'm so sorry, sorry, sorry this happened. Let's talk, talk, talk about it. Cluck, cluck. But Taylor didn't feel like talking. So the chicken left. Next came the bear. Grrr, roar, how horrible. I bet you feel so angry. Let's shout about it. Grrr, roar, grrr. But Taylor didn't feel like shouting. So the bear left. The elephant knew just what to do. Trump, da, I can fix this. We just need to remember exactly the way things were. But Taylor didn't feel like remembering. So the elephant also left. One by one they came. The hyena, hee hee. Let's laugh about it. The ostrich. Gulp. Let's hide and pretend nothing happened. The kangaroo. Tisk tisk. What a mess. Let's throw it all away. And the snake. Shh. Let's go knock down someone else's. But Taylor didn't feel like doing anything with anybody. So eventually, they all left until Taylor was alone. In the quiet, Taylor didn't even notice the rabbit. But it moved closer and closer until Taylor could feel its warm body. Together, they sat in silence until Taylor said, please stay with me. The rabbit listened. The rabbit listened as Taylor talked. The rabbit listened as Taylor shouted. The rabbit listened as Taylor remembered and laughed. The rabbit listened to Taylor's plans to hide, to throw everything away, to ruin things, for someone else. Through it all, the rabbit never left. And when the time was right, the rabbit listened to Taylor's plan to build again. I can't wait, Taylor said. It's going to be amazing. I hope you enjoyed listening to The Rabbit Listened by Corey Dorfeld. Next time we read this story, not only can we talk about what characters we identify with and why, but also we'll work on sequencing. What happened first, next, then, after that, and last or finally. 
I look forward to seeing you soon.